Hey, Jim and Lori, we're here at 273 Via Franciosa. Uh, this is a beautiful home with an amazing curb appeal. You are not on a cul-de-sac on this one, so it's gonna lack a little bit when it comes down to actual lot square feet. This one is 4,792 versus the previous one at 6,900 square feet on the lot. The home itself though is 2641 uh, square feet. And once again, I just wanna highlight, I love these, these doors. They're beautiful, super nice and heavy. You're greeted with a nice and large open floor plan uh, living room directly to your right hand side you have a half bath that leads into the garage we'll come back to that but here is the the living room something i noticed all the windows have plantation shutters throughout the entire home something else i would honestly do myself i'd knock this out um, this little half wall right here just knock it out now you have a even more open floor plan. But you have two little separate, you know, living areas right over here. Probably your living room over there and your family room is gonna be over here. Formal dining right behind us. The formal dining does lead into the kitchen, which has granite countertops, a very, almost like a dark granite countertops that, that honestly go very, very well with this cabinetry in my opinion. Cabinetry is nice, sturdy. Definitely not stained. I mean, they could use a little, some knobs, but other than that, I'd say it's in really good shape. The backyard here, like I was saying in the beginning, is a little bit smaller, but I'd say you have a good deal's worth of privacy um, with this massive wall over here. Let me get over to the corner so that you can get a good idea on how big it is not too much going on but like i but that honestly that just leaves you with an open kind of open background i mean open backyard to work with do whatever you guys really want with this so we come back inside We'll go into the garage real quick and check that out i actually have not seen the ac units Two car, two car garage. This one doesn't have that third car garage like that other one does. This one does also does not have a pan, um, but it is locked in, so it's all up to code. It does look like the original water heater. And when we get done with the upstairs, I will actually run back outside um, to try to find that AC unit. Upstairs, you have this really large loft area. It's very open up here. As you can see, let me get to the corner over here, upstairs. Right over here is the guest bathroom, double sink with a tub and shower. <laughs> Please do not use this toilet, I wonder why. Um, Yes, bedroom. So this house actually has four bedrooms. So something that I've, I've noticed that these bedrooms are um, a bit smaller than the other one that we came from. Here's the third bedroom. I'd say probably the smallest of the three. And into the master bedroom, double door leading into this huge master bedroom. Directly to your left-hand side, you have the master bath, shower, tub, double sink, and walk-in closet with another private toilet room. But that's the upstairs of this place. Very open floor plan. Um, I like the feel of, of, of this. Um, now the carpet here versus the carpet on the other one, it kind of gives me more of an office kind of, you know, feel like vibe when, it, when you step on this versus that other newer kind of carpet that they had going on, like a little bit more fluffier, probably harder to get dirty as well. Um, but everybody that's been walking through have been wearing booties or taking off their shoes, so that's a good thing. 
Let's go take a look and see if we can find that AC unit real quick. Oh yeah, these are much newer. Okay. So these homes were built, this, this home was built in 2006, but I'm not gonna lie, this AC unit looks a little bit nicer than the other one that we came from. Um, they are Comfort Walker. The AC inside is off. I will notate that. It's pretty hot inside the home. I'm sure it's just the owner um, trying to make sure that he doesn't use as much energy that he has to. But here's the label for the AC unit. Like I said, they look, they look nice. They look newer, at least nicer than the, than the other one that we saw at the other home, I would say. But. I hope you guys liked it, um, and if you guys have any other homes that you'd like me to check out and do a quick video for you uh, for, feel free to send it over my way. Thanks, guys.